Good morning. Look who's off to her long day at work. It's gonna be a very long day. You're not looking forward to it? Meh. 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 <laughs> what, what you got for lunch? Um, some carrots and cucumbers and crackers and cheese and a granola bar and yogurt. Do they have a fridge orator there? They do. Is it in the shape of a bank vault? <laughs> It is not. And it's also really disgusting and filthy, which she warned me, like, oh, well, there's a bunch of guys that work here, so it's just gross. And I'm like, okay. Oh, like, that's, no ex that's no excuse. Yeah, really, though. And I only saw, like, three or four guys, so... And there was three or four women, so it looks about 50-50. I think they were just trying to blame it on the guys. You can just keep it locked up in the yes. little sack. Yes, all my cat hair all over it. Well, enjoy your day at work. I'll try. I hope it goes quickly. So I'm all set up for my Twitch live stream. Got my cameras, my mics, my everything set up, my green screen. But the problem is, I can't get my racing wheel to work with Windows 8. I don't get it, it's plug and play, and when I plug it in, it just does nothing. I looked it up online, and it goes back and forth with some people that said they've got it to work with no proof. A majority of people that says it's just not compatible, which I don't understand. It's just a racing wheel, it's just inputs. It's beyond frustrating, so. I guess we're just gonna sit here and hang out and watch some YouTube videos. Look at me, there's me. Oh wait, uh, I guess you can always see if I put this here. How frustrating, first world problems I know, but you know, I spent a little bit of time getting this all set up so we could have some fun and play some games. We could play some other games, but the racing wheel, which I was really excited to play, is just not working. Lame. So fly update for you, not only is the fly still buzzing around here, it is mocking me. I swear I saw his little hands go ha 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 because I can't drive my steering wheel. Well played fly, well played. So although the gaming isn't going well, we are having a lot of fun on the live stream. As of right now we're watching cat videos, people are going to the chat room and linking us their favorite viral videos and we're just kind of watching them and hanging out and judging them. Everybody's got some cool stuff that I've never seen before. So it's been really interesting seeing everybody's perspective of what they think is funny. This Shaq commercial is my favorite thing that I've seen all day long. <laughs> oh, Shaq. Shazam always got me laughing. So five long, but feels like short hours later, my live stream is over. I've already showed you my live stream corner. And I think I'm going to do this again more, guys. I, it was really a lot of fun just hanging out with people, going through videos, making jokes and funnies. I really enjoyed it. I really feel energized. Kind of like, the only way I can describe it is after people go to the gym and afterwards they're like, I feel great. And after doing this, I feel great. I could have gone on for five more hours. But there's chores to do and Crystal will be home in an hour from her boring day at work, I'm sure. So I should get to cleaning and doing stuff. Gotta take down the green screen, put the house back into order, make the cats sign an NDA saying they won't speak about everything that happened today. All in an hour. Crystal was right. These donuts, it tastes excellent the next day. Yum. So look who made it home from work. How was your day today? Mentally exhausting. Yeah? Bunch of bunch of training. Of what? Everything. Everything? Everything. Does it show, did they talk about etiquette and how to treat people? Yeah, they talk about um, like elderly abuse and like... <laughs> what do you mean elderly abuse? That's not like, really? Elderly abuse? Like, like you I'm can't walk by field. somebody with a cane and kick their cane out from under them? No, it's about like um, old people's kids taking their money and stuff and like taking advantage of old people. Like taking advantage of old people? There's like a freaking section on that. Dang, I wonder how much that happens. That's crazy, I wonder what like... How? Like when old people get too old and then their kids are like, I'll take care of your money for you, and then they just spend their money. Oh, so you have to like look out for that, like look out for little Johnny coming in trying to drain Granny's bank account? Yes, exactly. Oh, sounds like an interesting day. It sounds like a lot of your job isn't just dishing out and taking money. It's like, it's like you're a, a, it's like you're a spy yes. or you have to look out for things that go wrong. Absolutely, there's a lot of stuff about that. Um, at least 50% of what I did, no, probably at least 75% of what I did today was about the sketchy things, the money laundering, and you know, things to look out for and how to report it. Because people aren't good people in this world, so you have to take a whole class on that. Yes. Back at it again tomorrow? Yes. Good luck. Thanks. All right, another day, another vlog. Short vlog today, but there wasn't really much things eventful. It's the ballad of the cats if you don't give them their food fast enough. Sorry, you're too late. 
Yeah. They're fit and quiet. And I noticed that they all go to the same area every time to get their food. That's because it's like a mathematical equation, and if you don't set it up correctly, it won't balance. What's the equation? Can you break it down? Mooch has to eat by himself. Because otherwise, he eats half his food and then starts pushing everybody else away and it throws off everybody. Um, the kitten also has to eat by herself because if she can see anybody else, she'll run away. Same goes for Clumpy. So they're kind of in their own corners. Tails and Kumiko are fine. So usually Tails' butt is in Kumiko's face while he eats and I put them there because they don't fight for each other's food. Hmm. And Tails will finish first. So he'll walk away and then Kumiko will move to her bowl, which gives everybody else in the other corners more time to finish their food. That makes sense. Before we go, Joel asked in the comments, we never talked about the origin of Kitty. What is the origin of the Like where'd she come cat? from? Correct. Oh, because we were getting ready to leave for work one day and somebody said, hey, come look out the window. And that somebody was me. And there was a little baby skeletal kitty sitting on the back patio and I can't see a starving cat without feeding it. So She was I spent, sketched out. I spent about 15 minutes out there luring her and I got her and then I took her to work with us. If you check my Instagram, you can see pictures from when we first got her. We took her to work with us and she sat there all day and then I took her to the store with me. I put her in like a fabric shopping bag to bring her into the store with me and sat her in the shopping cart so I could go get her kitty food because I did you really kitty food yeah remember the picture of her sitting in the the front of the like where the oh, kids sit I totally in the shopping cart I don't remember that yeah I snuck her into the store because she was all calm and I could still pick her up back then you know what I do remember is she pooped in your hand twice twice, twice. you want to see what happens when I pick her up now Sounds like she objects a little bit. Arms and legs out. She doesn't relax or anything. She doesn't enjoy it. She just looks around like, what's happening? Please put me down. She used to hide under the dishwasher. She did. She was tiny and she would hide between the dishwasher and the cupboard in the space that was like just as wide as her head and she would cram herself in there. Now she just hides behind the TV. But at night she comes and lays with me and snuggles with me in bed. She's like comfortable enough to do that and she goes under the covers and is happy. Except last night when she was snuggling me and then decided she was done and she went ah, on my face and now I have a hole here and a hole here. <laughs> I have a holy face. I do have a super holy face. She's gotten a lot better though over the, what, we've had her almost a year now? Two years. She's the really? same age as our friend Nanda's middle child. That's how I remember. Wow. Yes. She's not very big. No, she's a little runt. Well, the time goes by quick. She's not a big fan of canned food either. She's really picky about it. She'll lick it a little bit and she's like, meh. A lot of these guys ask, like, why do you have so many cats? Well, because what are we supposed to do with them after this? They show up and I can't just let them starve. We can't take them to the shelter, really. They'll get put down out here, for sure. Yeah. There's too many. There's too many cats per people out here, so... We live by a whole bunch of deserts, and they just breed. So we take them in, and we fix them, and we feed them, and make sure they don't have babies. Yep. We're the keeper of the cats. Pretty much. Everybody have a good night, and we'll see you tomorrow.